YSK if you look ugly in photos it doesn't mean you are ugly in real life. YYSK a lot of people look good in real life but their pictures come out bad and vice versa. The reason is that you're just not photogenic. It happens to a lot of people. In converting a 3D image like a person into a 2D image like a photo. Some features are lost we see in 3D because we have two eyes. And a camera has one eye that can only see in 2D so it doesn't get your facial features correct. Sometimes the camera literally flips the photo. Like a mirror. If you look beautiful in the mirror you're most likely very beautiful. Cameras distort reality. Usually in subtle ways. But people who take lots of portrait shots will tell you that posture can make a world of difference. Not because it changes the way you look in person. But because it strongly affects the way you show up on camera. I think some people instinctively have good camera posture and it does a lot for them. I'm even aware of extreme cases of people who look good in pictures even through they're not particularly attractive. That's why a lot of models look very attractive in photos but in real life um. So don't get depressed about your looks just because you don't look good enough in photos. Don't be too critical of yourself. A camera never capture your beauty but other people will. What if the mirror says I'm ugly too? Time for a LPT request how to look good in photos. Checked with my wife and mom separate people. They disagree. I'm ugly in real life. It's only when a toddler says you are ugly that you should start getting concerned. I have various friends who enjoy photography who get very annoyed that they can't seem to take a photo of me that actually looks like me. I'm super pale with soft features. So if I haven't done some serious contouring, I look like the moon emoji. I knew a guy in college who was hot in person, but looked extremely average in every photograph. I'm still baffled. If you don't believe this, I have an adorable dog who is horribly unphotogenic. If you get him at the right angle, he looks like a flat-faced dork in 2D. And he's not a pug or anything. He's a castle dog border collie mix. And he has an adorable puppy dog face and such sweet eyes and he's so expressive. But the camera does not always flatter him. If you think you look ugly because you look ugly in photos. You're calling my puppo ugly. 2. Couldn't agree more. The first time I truly saw this was years ago. I was dating a woman in her early 30s. About 5 feet 11 6 pack. All that. Her friend took a picture of us and IDK of it was the angle. The. But she looked like she was pushing 250 and ate cheeseburgers as bedtime mints. It was so bizarre. Didn't know my mom used Reddit. People often pair up with partners of similar physical attractiveness. So if your spouse is good looking, you probably are as well. For me, I look pretty good in the mirror. In real life people have said I could be a model or I'm beautiful. In group and far away photos I look good enough. But if I take a selfie or a close-up picture and the lighting or sunlight or angle is just a bit wrong I look like a mix of Jigsaw and the Grinch. Retired elementary art teacher here. We did some lessons that involved photography. Some kids have no idea how to smile for a photo. I told them to practice in front of a mirror. Some still had a hard time. So I kidded around with them and would smile and say I'm going to tickle your tummy every time. The sweetest natural smile would come across their face and I was quick enough to get the photo. YSK ugly in real life is the normal and correct way to exist until very recently. Yes. 
This really helped me have massive success in online dating. I undersold and over-delivered. I'm unattractive in photos and real life. But my husband loves me. Plus I'm old. So it's okay. Almost everyone my age is ugly. The other element is that when someone appreciates your inner beauty, kindness, intelligence, etc., you become even more beautiful. Conversely, when you may be gifted with many nice superficial traits, then act in an ugly way. Your ugly can not even be covered by thick makeup. I am happy to see a regular person with a kind and gentle smile any day. Being photogenic is all about holding your look and a pose at the time the camera clicks. People who are unphotogenic just don't look at a camera with the right intent. You can see how when a video call freezes even the most attractive person could look completely unattractive. Hold your head high. Chin straight and slightly up. Back straight or tall. And eyes big. Raise your eyebrows a little if you need to brighten up your eyes and smile like you just saw a great friend after a long time. Or my nose really is huge. YSK even though the above YSK is true. You can still be ugly. Likewise you can take a good photo and be ugly. You're probably not ugly. But you might be. Waiting for that one like camera scientist to be like. Actually cameras do not distort your image this way and you are in fact ugly. I modeled and the photographers always told me I wasn't photogenic so never published photos of me. In shows. Also. If you look good after photo editing doesn't mean you look good in real life. So I'm actually pretty. My mama was right then. Nah. You just ugly and that's okay. Doesn't mean you're not. Either. Don't get depressed about yourself because you don't look good in photos. Such good advice. Real depression professionals. Or depressionals. Like me get depressed for real reasons reasons like the unending and gnawing feeling that something you're doing or did earlier that day was wrong. What was it? And how was it wrong? These are need to know details. And all you need to know is that you did something. And it was wrong. So life screwed me over by having me born in an era where most people date using apps relying entirely on photos. I used to think I took bad pics but really I was just forcing it. My buddy dated a shutterbug back in the early 2000s. She would take these candid photos of us all. And they would always look so cool. It's because I wasn't standing there trying to force a smile while overthinking my posture. One of my friends is ridiculously hot. Like he is just drop dead gorgeous. Killer smile. Super attractive. Full package. Everything. And you'd never know it from photos. Gosh he looks goofy. Or creepy. Or just weird in every photo ever. It makes me feel better. Because I always look terrible in photos too. My daughter is stunning in real life. In photos. She usually looks like a potato. I just always look like a potato. Former photographer here. This is gospel. Corollary many models are people you'd walk right past in real life. Okay thanks. This was actually nice to read. I'm not a photogenic person at all. And I just had to have professional photos taken. I can barely look at them. I'm so embarrassed by myself. And I have noticed that I look different in the mirror compared to a photo. I'm just not my type. Are you my mom? I'm ugly and I'm proud. This gives me hope. 